with Deputy Dutson? When I was a kid, that's all I wanted to do was be a cop. Kindergarten, I remember there they had like contests about drawing or coloring items that would make you, you know, what whatever you want to be when you grow up and I won a contest in kindergarten, first grade and second place or second grade for drawing a policeman. And then I was always fascinated with the officer friendly that used to come to the school. I was like, wow, I'm gonna be a cop someday. Some of the things I used to do as a kid was I used to ride my bicycle around and with a notepad on Saturday mornings I'd go around and act like I was writing tickets and slip them inside the windshield uh, wiper blades up against the windshield and pretend like I was pulling people or jumping off my bikes, things like that. Always wanted to be a police officer, got married and kind of held off on that because my wife wasn't too big on myself becoming a police officer. Since it was a big desire, my wife could see that. I pursued that that dream and that goal, and so far I think everybody enjoys it. It is there is a risk to it, uh, but there's also a lot of enjoyment, and fulfillment. When we were first married, I was completely surprised when Garrett said he wanted to be a police officer, because I just pictured like the mean, tough guys wanting to be police officers, and Garrett was such a nice, mild-mannered person, and so I told him no. I I thought. He was too know, small. I thought he was too small. I thought he was too nice. And I said no, and I really didn't realize how much he wanted to become a police officer. But after a couple years, when he tried different things and kept going to back to the fact that he wanted to be a police officer, I realized that it was something he really, really wanted to do. And so I finally gave in and said yes. And I'm glad I did because once he entered police academy, he was the happiest man on earth. So one of my favorite things to do is to be home with my family. Uh, if, I, if that's one thing that I could just do all day, that would be hanging out with my wife and my kids, uh, doing something. Uh, we're kind of homebodies, but we also like to be outdoors. And we love movie night. Friday night, Saturday night, it's usually our big movie night in our home. And Movie night would be every night if you're at his way. <laughs> it relaxes you. We have a dirt box in the backyard. We love to play in the dirt, dig holes, build forts. We like to play with Legos. We're actually a Lego fanatic family. Our kids would rather go to Legoland than Disneyland. We have a room that's pretty much dedicated to Legos and some other toys, but you'll find the majority of the toys are just Legos. Our kids are very intrigued with those. We also enjoy playing family games. One of our favorite games to play is called Pounce. Uh, we get really into that game, and sometimes emotions come out that you don't don't see elsewhere in our family. So when I started with the sheriff's office back in 2007, I started working in the courts, and I was there for about six or seven months, and then from there I went out into patrol work and worked with our animal control division for about four years, and then from there I worked out in Eagle Mountain, and from Eagle Mountain to our traffic division and then from traffic division out to Vineyard City. I guess with the law enforcement or working with the sheriff's office, one of the things I have found that I really enjoy is going into the schools and teaching the kids about making good decisions, but also sharing with them the outcome of those decisions if, they, if they're not good, and try to encourage them or inspire them to become successful all around, just good people.